believe it or not, we haven't even played round one, and we're talking about players changing clubs, but you've got a fairly significant story on this one. Yeah, it's around Tom De Koning, uh, Ed, who's going to be uh, solo in the ruck tomorrow night in the first game against Richmond, which might be a good thing for him, because Carlton does want to keep him, but there's uh, three footy clubs very interested in him. You've got Hawthorne and Sydney, um, very, very keen, but the man who recruited him into the AFL system was Stephen Silvani, who was at Carlton at the time, and as of January this year is now at St Kilda. And I can tell you tonight that uh, Silvani has now made it known to people around De Koning that when he wants to engage in his future, which is expiring by a contractual sense at the end of this year, that he's going to be given an offer that may just be impossible to refuse. It's right, going we're to going to make an offer for you as well. We're going to buy you an earpiece in the next yeah. couple of weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Whack it back in. It's fallen out of view there, Damo. They it can't tell you to hurry just, up. Just on Tom, <laughs> he's played 33 games, but he's 200 centimetres, 100 kilos. On form, he's probably worth a $400,000 player. But to get him out of there, someone's going to have to pay him eight to nine hundred thousand. Oh, you reckon? I reckon he'd be that all day. What, but what he's achieved yeah. so far: thirty-three yeah. games, eleven goals. Yeah. So but far in his. Fair career. enough. So, Damo, the, the squeeze is on at Carlton. Obviously, they've got a talent up and down the spine. You, you've got Kerno, Mackay, just to name a couple, weedering down back. If he goes, does that ease the squeeze and does well, that allows them to go shopping? No, he hasn't go shopping. You mentioned Mackay as part of that spine. There could be another Mackay down back. And that is also something that Carlton is, is considering. If he, as North Melbourne, is fearful of him doing... So leaving ben North Mackay Melbourne, to North Melbourne, the brother. Yeah, the yeah. brother, the twin brother. Um, that, look, that, this is a contingency for Carlton as we speak because they want to retain De Koning as a starting point. But they're certainly open to uh, Ben Mackay uh, coming in. The Premier's Geelong face off against Collingwood. Ollie Henry's gone across, much to my chagrin. Mm. and disappointment and devastation because I reckon he's a gun player, I must admit. But his brother's in a bit of trouble with injury. Geelong have actually been pretty open with the injuries he's got, but we yeah, it's not that good. Yeah, look, just for those who, who don't uh, are aware, match simulation injury against Hawthorne late February. Sent to Queensland for surgery on a, knee, uh, on a on foot. foot. Yeah. The club statement on, on that day, February 27, was that this is a medium term injury. There is genuine fear and worry now that the medium could extend to longer term and what that means and how it looks let's see how, how it plays out but they're yet to uh, be assured that the medium term time frame they gave to it is going to be the case.